Is it better to be a talking head and stay still or to walk and talk with your videos? Hi, Taylor here with Financial Potion, where video is your financial potion. And to never miss out on a video, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and then click on that bell so you're notified every Friday at 5 p.m. Arizona time that a new video has been posted. For a one-to-one -one training or just to support our content, please click above and connect with us on our Patreon page. A lot of people ask me, should I be walking and talking during my videos or should I just stay still and do a talking head? Although talking heads can get boring if you have a long-winded conversation or a long-winded topic, it also can be very distracting to be walking and talking if it's not enhancing the video. So when should you be walking and talking? When you're giving a tour, when you're doing a real estate listing, when there's a purpose to leave and go into different areas and different scenes, then yes, you should be walking and talking. However, if you just wanna give a quick tip or a testimonial and you wanna keep them short, like we'd like to try to keep our tips short, then it's just good to set up a nice studio space and do a quick talking head. You're going to be able to get a lot more videos done a lot faster and they're not gonna be distracting. People are just gonna be focused on you. So what videos do you prefer? Talking head videos or ones that are walking and talking? Leave your comments below, and if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out.